Today I'm going to take you on a tour of a machine shed. Machine sheds come in many different shapes, sizes, and colors. Machine sheds are used to shelter machinery. Right now what you see is a semi pulling a grain trailer out of the machine shed. The semi is also known as a tractor and trailer. This machine shed was built big enough to hold the semi and trailer together. The semi is used to haul grain. Grain is what you would call corn or beans, which you see growing in fields around you. The semi hauls the grain to local co-ops to be sold. This particular semi is a 1973 Kenworth. The semi is almost 40 years old, but because it is parked in a machine shed for shelter, it still looks new. Next what you see is a tractor. Tractors are used to pull equipment like planters, plows, and wagons. This tractor is only used to pull the planter during planting season. During the off season, this tractor sits in the machine shed for shelter. This particular tractor is a 1967 John Deere. It is over 40 years old, but it also looks new because it sits in the machine shed for shelter. What you see now is a planter. The planter is pulled behind the tractor and is used to plant seed in the ground. Throughout the summer, those seeds grow into big, strong plants and will soon be ready for harvest. During harvest, you need a combine to get the crops out of the field and into the trailer. What you see on the front of the combine is a corn head. The corn head is used to pick the corn out of the field. The combine holds the corn until it is full and ready to be unloaded into the semi-trailer or even a wagon. Thank you for joining me on our tour of a machine shed. What you have seen are just a few pieces of machinery you will find in a machine shed. Hope you enjoyed your time with me inside the machine shed.